consider yourself an organized person or are you kind of a digital disaster when it comes to working with your computer? Are you one of those people that has a thousand icons on their desktop? And more importantly, when you open your browser, does it kind of look like this? Well, if it does, I'm going to give you a couple of quick tips inside the Chrome browser that might help you get a little bit more organized. Okay, so what we've got here is I just opened up my Chrome browser and uh, you can see at the top, and I think it's not as bad as the image I showed a couple of seconds ago, nothing, but you know, I got a number of tabs here that I kind of started off and about as organized as I ever used to be was limiting it to not having more than like 10 tabs open at any given time, but you know, they tend to build up nothing, as you're going through the workday. And in this case here, I have a couple of tabs I put together, at least in order, nothing, by having some YouTube stuff I had going on. I had a couple of tabs here, like three tabs open that, you know, is more around me looking at news, nothing, and, you know, from CNN to Yahoo, Google News, things like that. And then, of course, you know, any days, you know, not complete, you know, for the average geek, nothing without going to looking at something on Best Buy site, maybe even over at Newegg nothing, and uh, seeing what the latest deals are there and ways to spend money that you uh, shouldn't be spending. So how do I get this a little bit more organized and not have a thousand things flying around at once? Because I would have email tabs open and stuff like that, too, typically. Nothing, but for this purpose, I want to keep it as clean as possible and just kind of show the uh, the workflow. So one of the things you can do in Google Chrome that um, you know I hadn't been using for a while, I knew it was there, never really got around to figuring out how to go or use it, nothing, not that it's complicated, nothing, but once you kind of get using it and make it part of your workflow, it is a time saver or at least a, uh, a screen saver, <laughs> for lack of a better term. Um, so it's called, called Chrome Tabs, nothing, with uh, basically just having some ways to organize it. So if you right click on any one of the tabs, and I'll start over here in the YouTube uh, section, and if you right click on it, and you see over here, you can create Add to New Tab Group. Then, so if I click Add to New Tab Group, I can name this group, and I'll put in YouTube, nothing, just to have it named. And if you want a cutesy color, I'll go with red, nothing, because that's kind of the YouTube theme, nothing, and go ahead and click off of that. Now you'll see that red line that's going underneath that first tab. Well, if I go over to the next tab I have for YouTube and say add to tab group, now I can do either a new group like I did before, or now I can say YouTube. So now that red line's extending a little bit further. Same thing here. I'll go ahead and add to tab group, YouTube. Now, the nice thing about that is when you see the, the tab group over here uh, noted out, you can go ahead and click on that and it kind of collapses them all together. So if I want to get back, I just click on that tab again and I get to either one of them. But it kind of cleans up the, the taskbar here a little bit better at the top. And now I'm going to go ahead and just to do it again, go to tab group. I'm going to say new group and this one I'm going to call news. And I'll leave that gray because everything is pretty bleak with the news these days. And I will go ahead and add that to the news group. There's CNN added. Now we'll add Yahoo to that same news group. And now I have two of these groups put together and I can go back and forth between each of them, extend them both and I, or just collapse them down. So now I only have a couple things open. And last, just to do it one last time, we'll do another new, new group and I'll call this shopping. And we will put that as green because that's going to note money. Nothing and make me feel guilty for buying anything. And we'll go ahead and add the new egg one over to the shopping group. So now I have three groups here. I can collapse that one, go to news, collapse news, go back to YouTube, and it allows me to kind of go back and forth and take a look at events nothing and start playing around with uh you know my organization so it's kind of nice nothing to collapse things here it makes it a little bit less uh you know messy maybe a little bit more organized or at least makes me feel a little bit better about my organization skills uh going forward so hope this helps if you're using it already throw something in the comments i'd love to hear how you're using uh different types of organization stuff within your browser nothing and as always nothing if you enjoy this please subscribe and uh, we look forward to uh posting more as time goes on thanks again